Hi, my name is Julia Titus and I am a family practice nurse practitioner with Beacon Medical Group Goshen. I see patients from newborns all the way to older adults and we are accepting new patients in our practice. We are um, two nurse practitioners and three physicians and we would love to have you. Something that we may not think about is checking the medications in our medicine cabinet. And uh, one thing that's important is to make sure that we are checking for expiration dates. We wanna make sure that we're getting rid of things that are either not in use or past expiration date. Um, expired medications may lose potency or become ineffective. I would recommend doing that periodically, whether that is, you know, once a year, every six months, something to where you have a system in place so that you know exactly what you take and that the medication you have on hand is still within um, the date. Another important thing in regards to medications, whether it's over-the-counter or prescription medications, is that we keep them secure. It's not a bad idea to have them put away in a lockbox, especially if you have children in the home and certainly out of, out of sight and out of reach, because we know that even over-the-counter medications can be um, toxic if ingested, especially, you know, depending on what the medication is. And we certainly want um, to keep these put away. And if our kids are needing any type of medication, we always want that under adult supervision. So that's really, really important. If you ever have medications that need to be disposed of for whatever reason, maybe it's something that you're no longer taking and you, you no longer need, or if it's something that is expired, um, many local hospitals and or pharmacies will have drop boxes or even um, designated days where they take back medications. Um, it's never a good idea to just flush things down the toilet or anything like that. So definitely reaching out to one of these places to properly dispose of the medications uh, would be important. Always remember that your healthcare provider at Beacon is a great resource. Please reach out if you have additional questions. And if you are someone in need of a primary care provider, there are many different locations within our Beacon Health System that are taking new patients and are Beacon website is a great resource where you can find a list of all providers accepting new patients within our health system.